Dead boys don't know about statement. I don't know, so I need translation. Don't cat one more. All right. First of all, you want to add one video track, one audio track, another audio track, and another audio track. And you want to make sure your pro your project settings are correct. So you go to properties and make sure the frame rate is on um, 60. And make sure make sure the resample mode is disabled. This would look very ugly with Twix Store. Apply. Okay. All right. Drag your song in and find where the beat drops multiple times after each other. Like this. I don't know, so I need translation. I like that one. Like that. I don't know, so I need translation. Right. Zoom in on it. Press M on your keyboard to mark the beats. I don't know, so I need tra um, translation. And another one. Um. I don't know, so I need translation. All right. On the last beat, you want to sync your clip. Right there, where the gun shoots his first pellet. Right there, when you see this pellet coming out of the gun, you net you know that's why you want to sink it. Statement. I don't know, so I need translation. All right, split the clip. Go to effects. Search Twix store. All right. Once you got your trick store, drag it on to the clip and animate the speed. Add a keyframe right before the first marker by pressing Add Keyframe below here. Click on the marker. Put 150% speed in the middle between these two markers. You want to put 30% on the on the marker. You put 150 again and 30 again between between the two markers. On this marker, you want to drag it up until you see this. This will be around 300% speed. Now you go 10 frames out, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and then 30%. Alright, now you can re-render it by pressing Shift B on your keyboard. As you can hear, the audio is in sync. To fix that, select the audio and, pre and press Ctrl plus U. Find where the gun shoots his first. Right here. And drag the audio to it. Make sure the audio doesn't overlap. It's fixed. But the game problem is too loud, so drag it a bit down. That's good. Now add your swoosh sound. Swoosh and put it like that. Translation, 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 dunk, translation, dunk, translation, dunk, translation, dunk. Drag your clip a bit in. So it isn't too long. Translation. Don't cut one more. Mark. Mark. It's a bit boring. So you just add a keyframe a little bit out, but 400% velocity, and a little bit out again. You put 10. This isn't required, but it's just to make it look more interesting. So 
so we will just render it. So I don't know, so I need translation. Don't cat one more. I don't know, so I need translation. Don't cat one more. I don't know, so I need translation. Don't cat one more. Translation. Don't cat one more by price. Now you split the clip on the marker. Press S on your keyboard. All right. Add some shake. Animate it to the end of the clip. I still don't really like it. So I'm going to add some RGB to the clip. For me, the speed up doesn't look really good. So I'm going to remove that by holding control and clicking all the keyframes and delete it. It might look good on yours, so you want to look into that. And that's it. Thank you for watching. See you next time.